Yo, 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 what's up? It's your boy CJ Robinson Jr. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the show. Uh, so, first and foremost, I'm going to give a shout out to my uh, real supporters and subscribers. Alright, let's get down to it. WWE uh, SummerSlam results. I'm a little late on it, but I'm giving y'all my quick thought and review on it. I think that WWE has done a magnificent job bringing uh uh damn Becky Lynch back I was really in total shock when I seen Becky Lynch make her return at the pay-per-view in fact I wasn't just shocked and surprised that I seen her make her come back I was even more shocked and surprised when she beat the hell out of Carmella and challenged <laughs> Bianca Belair for the women's SmackDown women's title and beat her in less than three seconds max, if I'm correct. Yeah, that that was really a fucking shock. Like, you kind of made Bianca Belair look like an ass out there, Vince. But at the same time, I think a lot of uh, Becky Lynch fans and WWE fans in general knew eventually that that was going to happen when we seen Becky Lynch come out. So, with that being said, um, they still did a fantastic job bringing her back early. Uh, and the Olympians, uh, uh, what's his name, Gable? Not Chad Gable, the uh, the black Olympic hero, uh, Olympic gold medalist uh, Gable, and the black chick I forgot her name. They made their appearances there in WWE, and uh, right now both of them are probably are in discussion of um, signing a contract with the WWE. I think that'll be awesome because I watched those do in the Olympics, you no know, doing this wrestling thing. Back in the day, I was able to watch Brock Lesnar do his thing. I always said, damn, Brock should be a WWE superstar. And, you know, of course, he made it happen years later. About two years, two or three years later. <clears throat> I think that uh, Gable, the black guy Gable, who just won a gold medal, I think he's going to be perfect for the company. Uh, I think he's going to be freaking <clears throat> Freaking epic, freaking awesome, as well as the black chick. Uh, forgive me, y'all, I don't remember her name. Uh, let's get down to the fact that uh, Becky Lynch got one of the biggest pops from the crowd. That's like probably the biggest freaking positive reaction in years from any returning superstar. That her pop was louder than John Cena's return. So, you know, uh, Cena, no, he, I, I, shout out to John Cena, man, for actually, uh, actually putting it in the script for him to be the, for, to let Roman Reigns beat him. Giving Roman Reigns a bigger, you no know, push by letting him beat him. No, that was very nice of John Cena to do, man. Most people still to this day say John Cena uh, always screws the up-and-coming talent over all this crap. But make no mistake, John Cena has done everything there is to do in the business. If he want to retire now, he can do so, but he'll probably do one more match in WrestleMania. You never know. So, with that being said, that's my SummerSlam recap. Uh, CM Punk, like I said, I did a video on that already, a, a live stream. CM Punk made headlines at AEW. He had one of the bigger pops than Becky Lynch did. CM Punk is famously known for um, his real antics and shit back in WWE a few years ago, but CM Punk has also made a lot of fucking money and made a huge impact in his professional wrestling career. So kudos to CM Punk, man. AEW is where it's at. CM Punk is about to take AEW to a whole nother level. I seen the press conference between Tony Khan, the CEO and owner of 
AEW and um, motherfucking CM Punk at a press conference on uh, YouTube and you know the look in Tony Khan's face will be the same look I will have in my face. Uh, it's like a kid who is a huge wrestling fan, man, up and down. So that that was awesome, man. Uh, Goldberg's son is said to be currently training. But, you no, know, he has no kind of muscle. And the only way I know Vince will sign him is because he's Goldberg's son. You know, like Rey Mysterio. You no, know, he's not a big, he's not a big, tall superstar. You no, know, Vince wants tall, muscular wrestlers. But, you know, only because the second and third generation wrestlers, man. You know, Rey Mysterio's son is a third generation wrestler. Rey Mysterio... Junior is a second generation wrestler because Rey Mysterio, his father was a wrestler. You know what I'm saying? I, I know my I know my wrestling history. So uh, anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell button. We're gonna do some more news recap on another live stream later on today. Uh, stay tuned. Love you all. Stay blessed. Stay COVID free. And remember, knowledge is power. And to that, uh, and to that. Uh, idiot who unsubscribed to me I, I knew he was gonna do it eventually uh tommy follower a tommy follower yeah i forgot i forgot his name but uh hey that's why that's why you no know, i really don't i don't really call nobody on here uh brothers and except for a french dose and we're just one on the internet man but kudos to uh everyone who's no, stuck by me this far. Whew. Once again, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell button, continue to show me some support uh, as I bring y'all some great content. Oh, the new video, Trap Still Jumping, will be officially released. The full video will be released on the 28th, guys. Once I got my hands on it, I will upload it to my channel. Show my brothers, my stepbrothers, video some more support, man, because these guys, these boys can rap. I can rap too. These boys can rap, though. You know what I'm saying? They taught me how to rap. So, yeah, man. I mean, so, y'all just show y'all boys some love and support, man. Show show my brothers some support, because, you know, we, we up in comers, man. You know what I'm saying? So, that's just how it is. Shout out to my cousin Mo Cheddar. Y'all support Mo Cheddar's uh, YouTube channel. You no, know, subscribe to his channel. He got new. He just uploaded a new vid music video to his channel as well. He got a new music video out, shit. So guys, with that being said, I'm about to hit the road. I got shit to do. Love y'all. When I get back to the crib, I'm gonna get up on the live stream. We're gonna do some discussion talks and uh, news re news reports and stuff like that, man. So much shit going on right now. It's crazy. So. That's about it, guys. That's my. That's pretty much all I gotta say for now in this regular video. I'll see y'all soon. Remember, knowledge is power. CJ, signing out.